Ramhorn, stop scraping your ass on the ground like a dog! Ramhorn! Stop! No! <laughs> Ramhorn originally started off in Generation 1 as one of the many cassette Autobots following the cool sly blaster. Mmm, making me wet just thinking about it. Sadly, he no longer transforms into the classic cassette, but finds purpose in the Titan Master vehicle line, which I'm oddly okay with. While the original figure never came with the headmaster of any kind, I'm loving this little thing aside from the robot head. I have no problem with the look, it's very unique, but because of its round shape, it pops off the Titan Master joint way too easily. Look at this, the gorgeous colors with dabs of silver, blue, and ooh, look at the brown on this. If your favorite color is brown, why is your favorite color brown? In head mode, wow, okay. For a character that never had a proper robot mode, this Titan Master is one handsome fella. The molding and shaping on this guy makes me wish I had a proper body to use it for. Eh, sometimes I'll throw it on Chrome Dome and it works. Apparently, this is based on an unreleased Rhino Headmaster Warrior. If that means anything. Those fucking ears matching the rhino. Mmm, hello handsome, where have you been all my life? For the rhino, you'll notice a giant empty cavity. You can use any Titan Master to fill out this section, but why swap it out with the colors? It's gay. I feel like this figure could have been improved with more articulation. You can't move the legs back from here, but I think the scale and design fits for a remold of Shuffler. And for anyone crying out for a Legends version, should I remind you that the animal ones aren't that good? Yeah. I love the head design. The only issue I have is if you mess with it, the head joints might move out of place. Though if you want, you can move the horn forward and use it as a weapon. God is a comedian. I love the weapons imitating the original and giving him added firepower. Oh, the tail? Don't even get me started on the tail. Ramhorn, you know horny. But what if you want Ramhorn to be a tank? I don't know why you want that, but all right. The only thing I don't like is the head forming something. You can remove it using the mushroom joint, but yeah. Other than that, the legs being used for the treads works way better than I imagined, and the Titan Master can man this from the back using two pegs attached to the feet. Yes, this is nothing from the original, but I can't help but have fun with it. For the weapon mode, I mean, I've seen worse. The Rhino Head's not doing it any favors. I mean, come on! However, the missile pods alongside the gold weapons that become relevant again, I mean, can't argue. He may not be able to be thrown into Blaster's chest, but at least you can add him as a weapon. So you see, he could still be on Team Edward. I mean, shit! You could still use the Titan Master in this mode to fill in the gap, but it's not gonna affect it too much with it removed. As I mentioned, the Legends cassette minion animal toys haven't been great, but I think Ramhorn got the better deal. It would be nice to see a Legends version, but I'm not sure if that figure would be good. I think as far as what we got, it's actually really impressive how everything fits. Out of the majority of these Titan Master vehicles, I think Ramhorn is one who takes the cake. Heads up, reportedly he did get two releases in two colors. Not sure why, but I can't make the comparison. As of recording this, the Ramhorn you see in the video is the only one I ever found. He's the only new figure of the wave, so if you want him, get him fast. It makes sense, rhinos are apparently endangered. Was that joke in poor taste? Toilet. <laughs>